Today on the Printasource, I've decided to do a video on adding a second AMS unit. Some of these tools I've found to be beneficial to the removal of the PTFE tube. You will obviously need a second AMS for this install, and you will also need a AMS hub. The hub allows up to four AMS units to be connected instead of the single. And here is how I disconnected everything. You just disconnect your PTFE tube from the printer. Uh, I found it easiest to pull the wire plugged into the printer and then remove those two screws and then disconnecting everything with the AMS off of the printer. And here's what it looks like reinstalled with the new AMS hub. I picked out a AMS stand that I liked off of Maker World. I will have that link in the description of this video. And it printed fairly easy, it took about 16 hours. Here's all the pieces laid out. Once you've got your stand figured out and set up, it's gonna look like something like this, two AMS units plugged into a hub. Uh, when you turn on your printer, you may need to do an update, but it does detect that secondary AMS. And here you can see AMS one and two listed. This is what my setup ended up looking like. And the first thing I ended up printing was a Printasource logo. I will show how to do that in another video. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment.